So I kind of want Steve and Jen to be my parents. Who doesn't? Can you tell me about how it was having them as pretend movie parents? It was great. It was really fun to work. They were amazing to work with, uh, really funny, really talented, and they would be the best parents ever. It would be amazing. Mm. Them as a team is kind of kind of incredible. And um, yeah, I feel like we learned a lot from them, which is something you don't you don't really say about parents, but it, I mean, yeah. it's true. You learn. We a did. Lot we from took away parents. a lot from them. T movie parents or otherwise. Exactly. Yeah, it's fun to see them do the physical comedy. Were there moments when you found it hard to keep it together on set? All the time. Yeah, yeah I mean, pretty much non-stop <laughs> yeah. to keep it together. Yeah. So, mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Well, i got to say, Ed, I didn't even know you were Australian when I was watching the movie. <laughs> That's a true compliment Thank you. because you would be able to spot it so easily. Yeah. <laughs> you do the accent so well. Thank you so much. How hard did you have to work on it? Because also you have to say the word Australia a lot, which mm -hmm. is hard not to say in your own accent. Yeah. That makes yeah. sense. Yeah. That's so true. It, yeah. That was a word that we yeah. definitely worked on, Australia. Emu, because yeah. we all pronounce it emu. And so I was like, guys, it's emu. But Stop, you it. yeah. please. Um, yeah, but I, I did a lot of training. And I just learned the little tips and tricks that made it really sound authentic and really real. Yeah. Yeah, you did a great job. Thank and you. And I love how much Australia is in this movie as well. Yeah, it's really cool. It's did you guys learn a lot about Australian wildlife, i.e. everything will kill you? Yes. In Australia? We definitely did, yeah. Yeah. especially from Ed. Yeah. There were so many stereotypes, and I just went, nope, that yeah. can kill you, nope, that can kill the you. The cuter the animal, the more vicious it is, it seems. Unfortunately. Yeah. Except for um, the wall. Except, except for Winston. Winston's they can pretty walk. nice, but they're, they, they can be feisty, right? Oh, right? yeah. Yes. Wallabies can be feisty. They can, too. but when they're little, they're cute. Yeah. yeah. Kangaroos can be feisty yeah. as well. Yeah. Very feisty. <laughs> well, this movie, I, I didn't read the book, so I'm not sure exactly how similar they are, but I hear that it's a continuation of the story of the book. Yeah. Would you say that's correct? Yes. Yeah. yeah, it sort of takes the, the character of Alexander and the story and his bad days and sort of t uses that as a jumping off point so that you can, you know, follow the family. And, and my character's not even in the book, so it sort of expands in a lot of ways. But, um, mm. you know, I think it maintains the same sort of energy and the feeling that it has uh, in the book. Yeah. Is this a type of movie that you guys would like to watch if you weren't in the film? Yes. I think it would be, yeah. Well, especially because it, it reminds me of uh, the kind of movies that I grew up watching like as a kid and that I, I still love to this day and that are very nostalgic. So um, it's very refreshing to me. I, if I saw the trailer for this and had nothing to do with it, yeah. I'd say, that's new and I want to go see that. And yeah. I go see it with friends, with family, anything. Yeah. Yeah, because it's sweet, but at the same time it does have a different message that, you know, sometimes it's just a bad day. Yeah. And that's okay. You can call it a bad day. It doesn't yeah. have to be silver linings yeah. all the time. Yeah, you'll so get through it, you know. It, every, you, you always uh, prevail somehow. Yeah, and it's, it's, I think it's like a realistic and sort of honest, like you said, it's not everything goes perfectly well and, and you sort of have to accept that and, and band together. Hey everyone, if you like this video, click that thumbs up button and make sure to subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and helps you stay up to date with all the latest movie news as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, make sure that you follow us on Facebook and Twitter to stay up to date with all of our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.